Are you serious? Are you serious? Well, folks, we've got a terrible situation developing in India. 64 people are dead at an India hospital because they have, they've run out of oxygen. No oxygen. Matter of fact, at least 64 children have died over the last six days at a government hospital in northern India after they suffered oxygen shortages. Authorities have launched an inquiry into the cases of the oxygen disruption, but denied reports it had caused the deaths at the hospital. Matter of fact, India media says 30 children died on Thursday and Friday because of lack of oxygen on the wards. Suppliers' bills had allegedly not been paid. 60 patients have died. It's now 64. At the hospital in the last five days, but we're, we don't think it's linked to reports of oxygen shortage. But State Health Minister uh, Siddharth Sangi announced later that four more people had died today, taking the death toll to 64. And Singhi denied that any of the deaths were linked to oxygen shortage. 23 children died Thursday with another seven on Friday, according to the reports. And with 64 dead in the last few days, all hell has broke loose. The Hindustan Times newspaper described the chaotic scene at the hospital as oxygen supply was disrupted. Even as 90 jumbo oxygen cylinders were passed, were pressed into service to maintain the supply the hospital ran out of oxygen around 1 a.m. Uh, it's just a, it's a sad, sad scene in northern India at this hospital. As children are dying, it's a massacre from the lack of oxygen and medical supplies. This is a terrible story. Please pray for the people of India. And I said today, I preached a funeral today from a man from India uh, and just uh, how he had come to the Gurney, Illinois conference and how God had moved so mightily. Matter of fact, I even called this man, his whole family, out of the crowd to pray for them and to anoint them. I did not know who they were. And, uh, and so he died over the weekend. Uh, I mean, excuse me, he died this week, and I have preached his funeral today. But I can tell you that the need in India is great. I've been there, and I've preached... Uh, a crusade there and I've preached in little villages all over the jungles of Orissa and the need is tremendous. I was in uh, Mumbai and I was in New Delhi and I was in Calcutta and I've seen the suffering and the carnage and the, and, the, and, the, and the pain of the dying in the streets of Calcutta and I can tell you we need to pray for the people of India. They're beautiful people and there's a great move of God there. So please pray for the people of India.